Yeah, just say welcome back to Ubunifu. Space. Space. So today this is a new segment called Utamaduni Box, and uh, we're talking about cultures and curators coming in. So what's the name? Joe, Joe, Let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> Super sad. Okay, so I'm just gonna and we are your hosts, Jazz. And I'm Ray. So basically what this episode is going to be focused on, it is the New Nairobi and the Shrap scene. So for those of you who do not know what New Nairobi is, New Nairobi uh, came up in 2015-2016, establishing themselves as indigo artists, just underground artists who deal with a lot of good vibrations in their music and their sound, sending a positive message and a positive vibe with their music. Whereas Shrap is the other side of it. They have a message, a Kenyan message. They utilize shank, rap and hip hop and they bring an entire new meaning to urban hip hop in the Nairobi scene. So would you guys first of all classify yourself as Shrap or in the Nairobi? Mm, I can see both. Cause from your definition, like Shrap is under New Nairobi. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So basically, uh, you you are part, Shrap is part of New Nairobi. Okay, it's, it wasn't part when I came up with it, <laughs> but like right now, like when like you can see the definitions, like it's like this New Nairobi is more like broad. It's broad, yeah. yeah it's, it's a movement. Like, it's like a movement. And uh, Shrap music Shrap is, is a like uh, sound. Yeah, it's like a sound, yeah. All right. Okay. So it's under New Nairobi. Right. Yeah. And it's the same for you guys, where do you guys fall? I don't even know if we're really in Ni New Nairobi. I feel yeah. like we've fallen into that category. Because even us, we don't know what we are. So <laughs> same. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So yeah. Just making yeah. music and then you know you guys yeah. are like, ah, yeah, New Nairobi shrubs, so we're like, ah. Let me just say so. They're everything. They're yeah, they were just like New Nairobi, like, is it like any, like, what does the any stand for? It's just new, new, new. It's like new, new, new. Yeah, no, you know, like the new, new, new. Underground, underground. We have to. So we didn't come up with this. These terms. This is a conspiracy. This is the new in New Nairobi. What does it mean? We need to compare. What do you think that the new in New Nairobi stands for? Comment down below. Um, so the reason we're having even this discussion, it's great that you guys even are asking these questions uh, because, well, it's not great because we were hoping you give us the answers. <laughs> yeah. um, but it first came about the whole issue of Shrap versus New Nairobi in a documentary by Fact Magazine, which we will link in the bio down below, where you had um, artists who did classify themselves as just Shrap artists and New Nairobi artists who classified themselves as just New Nairobi talking about how the two worlds do not intertwine. You cannot have collaborations between them or they haven't been or they're not around the same people in the same events. And it's interesting to see these gentlemen here because they obviously take their sounds to different levels and show us that that isn't the case. So you can have a good mix of the two. You guys are actually working together. So if yeah. you could tell us a little bit more about those projects. I feel like it's just like, misconceptions like if you listen into it too much then you'll be like ah i can't like do this because you know like people say that it's like not cool but like because even us we just met we vibed we were just like yo we should work on something and like it happened <laughs> so it's like it's up to the people honestly like the artists themselves it's not really about the scene like, it's more yeah. like we put it out a little it's for them to interpret so I really love to see that it's, it's for your liking. Okay. So basically, you guys don't have a sound. No, yeah. we just haven't categorized. Yeah, 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 we have a sound. Yeah, we have a sound. It's there. Everything needs a name. Because you know, if you do that, you'll, you'll end up boxing it. Yeah, so Because exactly. if you say we're, we're just rappers, like, so we're not going to work with singers. We're not going to work with. Like, we're not just going to yeah. make a song that has yeah, just vocals. because of. Yeah. Because yeah. 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 we're like doing their own thing, trying to like. So you define the, the thing. So reaching out is just a matter of meeting each other. Like 
I don't know fate or time. Yeah. 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 Most of the time, most of the time, before you even get yeah. most, <laughs> most of the time, <laughs> most, of the time <laughs> most of the time, like even when I'm personally making music with just even Baraka, like we're not gonna be like, okay, so let's make a jazz jam, like jazz jam. Let's yeah. make a hip hop jam. Like, it's just like the mood. Let's make good it's music. Just, it's just a mood. Yes, like, you're always having that, that mentality of let's make good music. Let's like, make essentially, it's meant to be good music, but you know, it's more of like a vibe. Yeah. Because that's what we just do. Like that's how we we even ended up make, making music with Joby. Like it was just a vibe. Yeah. It wasn't like because if we thought about yeah. it, like so we new Nairobi, yeah. trap. We have to really work with this. Yeah, yeah, that's what we do. Luna Robbie because yeah. they they know you're like so, you're, you're a trapper, so they try and make like a beat like that yeah. suits you. That suits you. Yeah. Yeah. That probably you like you two meeting up with each other and like making. And probably he could go like, yo, I have this beat. Can you take a listen to it? Yeah. Probably. Yeah. Can you jump in and do a music together? Yeah. The whole point yeah. of like collaborating with people is like you get to like experience their view of like how they create like i'm not gonna True. meet up with him and then like just make a trap beat just because it's, it's, it's him shot, yeah. Yeah. i won't do like what i usually do and he will definitely yeah. okay i'm probably getting i'm also like <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, it's like, like, a it's 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 new environment yeah, yeah. I mean, no but yeah. i feel like it blends in well because it's like if like this what we worked on like he did his thing like with his flow and like they produce like that beat with like that sound like so it wasn't what you're used to but like you know when you hear it you're like you know what it is but it's like it's combined in such a way you're even like whoa like yeah yeah that's even like that's what i told uh jinku sent me a beat but then like the beat was like i, I told him like if you wanna work, like you just call her, like we meet up, like we just blend, we start something from scratch. From scratch, right? Like, more like yeah, organic, organic, yeah. To cut ticket. I mean, how do you feel? Like, do you get a lot of producers who hit you up, and the sound is always that trap sort of beat, like? All, all of them is, is yeah. trap, because obviously they're hitting you up because they feel like they've made something for you. But it's not all those sounds. Like Pretty you wouldn't vibe with all of that, right. so yeah, like yeah. some of them are cool, <laughs> but others in Asana too. Think about it. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Like we give that to Gap. Yeah. So now if you're gonna hit up Jovi, don't come with your trap yeah. beats. <laughs> <laughs> you guys need to come up, follow, you know, meet the studio in Patane, cook the cookies or music, you know, from scratch, because that's what we need. <laughs> 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 hit that sauce. Yeah. <laughs> How did you guys meet? Like. How did that happen? Did you actually hit him up like, hey, I have a beat for you, or did you just? Nah, it was just let's meet up. From, but we used to like, nah, we, we used to like, like see each other. Yeah, yeah. Like, alchemist. Yeah, alchemist, alchemist, the alchemist, and then Miles. Yeah, yeah. 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 Alchemist first, and then Miles. Yeah, man. Yeah. 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 It was just one of those like, moments. Good luck, man. Because we're just bad, we're like homies, like you just. Yeah, because you can't be like, okay, me, me, I'm doing shrub and my homie is doing, so we can't do music. <laughs> and your homies, because, hey, Jovi, ni are a reform, so to so ah, make like, up. You know, you and I had this guy's music and like, hey, we should get a bomb. Yeah, Jogging a rope. So, like, it feels really organic. Like, it's not really I also had like Baraka's sound, like. Mm. Sound like it's crazy. Yeah. There's also like things we have in common, like we vibe. So like, yeah, we just like before we met, like we knew about each other somehow. Like, yeah. Oh, we started listening to music. That's why I say Nairobi small. Like this time, man. Yeah, never know. The Nairobi creative scene, yeah, it's super small. But it's funny how it's super small, right? But you still don't have that. Like I personally, um, I've been in the scene for since 2016. And I can say, like, without a doubt, concretely, this is the first time I've seen a collaboration like this. You know, you have, like, I'm not going to name names, but you have <laughs> the more mainstream New Nairobi artists and the more mainstream shop artists, and there's never been that. And same, like, they vibe, they meet at events, blah, 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 but they've never, or at least I've not seen to now, them sit down and say, hey, let's work together, or let's hang out and let's do something together. 
yeah, so it's super interesting to see you guys do that. And then for you guys to say we don't even categorize ourselves yeah. into either side or both sides or whatever. And um, like the, the direction that you guys are taking, me fit to sound because because uh, you find later on, like later on, you you guys jakuta unite as a group. Because right now, na pata they are different movements, but once you guys come together, you create a, a, a whole industry. Yeah. Yeah. Right. See, yeah. Yeah. then you guys can do collabs. You know, na pata na umse yo yo niyazi. So we so we link up, mm. love to do to, to, to like chop music up like one. One main sound. Yeah, it's like the grand. Is the like the grand scene in UK? Yeah. They came together. Yeah, it can't come up as. It can't come up as one person. Yeah, yeah. 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 People will hear about it even like Kenyan music as a whole. Like if it's just Saudi soul, they'll just be like, ah, it's just like some guy just Kenyan just making music. But if now it's a scene, they'll be like, hey, it's Joe, Joe is like super soul, Kumbo, like. Not even just us. There's other amazing artists, yeah. you know. Yeah. And then they hear about that, so it's like, hey, Kenya is really popping. Like, Ooh. it's better when you come up as like, there's so much going on rather than just, ah, like, yeah, me, I'm popping. Because, <laughs> because the consistency that you guys have is amazing. Because yeah. you find there are a lot of underground rappers that say, ah, man, say. Nisi get his up to talk about saying, Nisi get, but I couldn't consistency. But you guys, because me, I see a lot of visuals and uh, like underground rappers. I see like you know the ad family, uh, Joby. I see their videos. They go for these events and they're actually putting in a lot of a lot of work. And that's I think probably the scene needs to to do like yeah. the underground scene. Yeah, yeah, it's work definitely. I mean, what do you think? Nah, me, I agree as well. Because even for us. Like we've seen that, like yo, this guy, like, he puts in work. Like yeah, like, we can make something. Like, cause you're not going to like want to work with someone who doesn't really yeah. put in work. Different type of music is what like the Nairobi scene actually needs. Yeah, cause we need like diversity. Cause mm. like we've been having this conversation with Mark, and, like which also t- like doing this collaboration is like finding similarities and the diversity. Cause. If we, if we all have one sound, it's going to be so monotonous. It won't be even like it won't it won't make sense. You know, like you have to give everyone has to have that diversity so that we feed everyone. Everyone does yeah. not like the same thing, yeah. and we appreciate that. So we, we put something out that's going to have probably this amount, this type of people want to listen to it. But you know, at the end, if you look at it, like we have our type of supporters. He has his type of supporters. So like if they both link and listen to the song and what's up, you know, that's like. Double supporters. Yeah, that's, double up that's, their supporters. Yeah, it doubles up supporters plus it shows that you know there's, <laughs> there's more. There's that TVT that's <laughs> yeah, coming yeah. through. Yeah, and you know at yeah. the end, like if we keep on doing this, we actually like we're beyond just artists, like we're homies, like we chill yeah. before we actually yeah. do it. You know that makes it even more organic. And if like the scene grows like in that sense, it can never reach a point where you this backlash between <laughs> people because you're all homies. Yeah. You're all homies at the end. You know, it's more than the music at the end. Yeah. 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 So, like, no, I just remembered, like, hey, I have to say this. You know, like, we made that jam, we made the jam with Jovi, and then after that, like, we went to Alchemist and, like, yo. Immediately after, and, like, the jam is done, the jam is done. We went and, like, we went and. Went hard, yeah, we went hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that's much better than just going like studio session. Then you leave as you bought talk. And you say, I okay, see you next time. Yeah. Yeah. See you next time, or you don't even hit them up later because you see, like in that sense, where we went out together, like it's because we were actually vibing. Yeah, yeah. And uh, does Nuna Robi like do do rappers from probably Mombasa? Do they like? belong to Nairobi, or is it like just centered in? I feel like this the artist. Man. Yeah. Okay. Like what you're yeah. doing. Yeah. When he says it, or he or she says it, like I'm doing like this type of sound. Like this is Nairobi. Yeah, because mm-hmm. now everyone is like coming up with their own thing, mm-hmm. yeah. which is good. Because yeah, no, yeah. change is <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. 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 And nowadays it's easy to get studios, man. People have studios in their yeah, lives. Yeah. 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 Like, <laughs> and it's not like it's a whole like. Uh, artists didn't have knowledge about like all that stuff. Nowadays, at the artists produce their own music, master their own music. Mm-hmm. So it comes down to the artist. It feels like, yo, I'm making like new Nairobi stuff. So something that I hear a lot from people who are coming up and want want to classify themselves as new Nairobi as or as trap is that they say there's a lot of click 
sort of like like click mentality that if these are now how you guys are saying we need to work together but we also need to be friends people don't work with anyone who isn't their homie do you guys see that do you guys see that whole thing like yeah it's kind of like that too. yeah, yeah. it's either you're my homie or i'm getting like i'm like Another yeah, like there's something I'll get yeah. from you working with me, like. Yeah. Right. But usually those songs, uh, they don't come out like yeah, as bad as fire. Yeah. fire. Yeah. Yeah. It just, it probably sounds good because it's articulate, but it's not vibing. So vibing music is the way to go. Two K nineteen. So guys, um, thank you so much for coming and having this conversation with us. Thank you for having us. Um, we hope to see you guys maybe on the show at an event next time. Yeah. Drop some bars if you're willing yeah. to do that yeah. now. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, that's true. And even regulate yeah. the, the the places. Like, yo, there's so many places, yeah, yeah, yeah. and everything doesn't have to be on the west side of Nairobi. Like, <laughs> there's so many people. Like, I work with from my ends, which is Islam, and every, like, there's so much that's happening, and people are just sleeping on it. And so is focusing true, on like what's happening west, west side. Yeah. Even the people in the east end, yes. there's yes. happening. Yes, yes. even them, the more the, the, it's like. They're also getting too concerned with what's happening with that, and like our size is like Wakandi Nani. There's so many people that are doing Nani is really good. Yeah, yeah, and they're really good. The performances, the performances are really good. You actually go out. Even ski music. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Shout out to Skins. Shout out to Nani. Shout out to Ted. Shout out to Ted. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's episode. We will have the guys' links. in the bios or on their faces yeah, somewhere you will find them is there anything we should look out for any new projects yeah, yeah yes yes you should yes. Yes. Too, much. Too, too much, much. too much you're going to get an excuse yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to be hard like you know we're just going to leave it at like yeah. it's coming to me and to me like i have been like we shot next team you yeah. know you might have been doing like you might leave the interview and then like a ton of music up all like i'm okay Um so yeah until next time <laughs> we will catch you later